Hello, good day to you. My name is Chris and I'm going to show you how to add consecutive dates to a multi-tabbed spreadsheet that you would use for example a timesheet or a spreadsheet that tracks progression and you need to see the dates of those individual tabs. If you're like me, you've looked on the internet and for some reason, they're putting in all these complicated formulas and you're trying to follow along and it's just unnecessary. I'm going to show you a quick and easy way that you can do this. Um, so first things first, um, create a spreadsheet. I'm, uh, I'm going to assume that you can do that. Simple enough. Add sheets, name them Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then on A2, put in date. And on A3, on uh, what we're going to do is we're going to make sure that it is formatted. And in this particular uh, circumstance, I'm doing it as a long date. And then on the following pages, you need to do the same thing. I have date there. And then on that particular uh, A3 cell, I made it the long date. Make sure you do that for all the following uh, uh, tabs. Okay, so. Um, I uh, put in the date uh, for uh, August 3rd on Monday, and now I want on Tuesday, I want this to show the sequential date. How do I do that? I'm going to show you right now. First, we're going to put in this formula. Um, if I talk too fast, I, I apologize, but it, this is pretty straightforward, and a lot of you probably just want to get the information and go anyway. So first things first, equals, you're going to refer to this cell. And then you're going to say, because it's the next day on Tuesday, you add one. Enter. And now look. Boom. Monday and Tuesday. It's already added the day. Now I want to do the same thing with Wednesday. So Wednesday, I do the same thing just for um, emphasis. Equals. Refer back to here. That day. Plus two because that's Wednesday is two days after and you can see that now Monday Tuesday Wednesday days increasing we'll just do the same thing for Thursday just for making sure that we've got this solidified equals Monday the same cell and because it's now uh, three days it's plus three boom so Thursday, okay, and then the last Friday, we're going to go here, click, boom, plus four days, one, two, three, four, enter, and look at that. Now, here's what's really cool, is that, okay, I'd like to use the same, I don't want to have to keep putting this formula in. Uh, again, for the following week, for all my employees and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. So all I got to do, go to Monday. Hey, what would be the following week? Um, so if it was Friday, Saturday, Sunday, that would be eight nine. So it'd be ten, eight ten. So how do I do that? I just do this, eight ten. Boom. Oh, it's done that. Now look at watch Tuesday. Uh oh, hold on a second. You know how to do this, right? Double click. Boom. Wednesday, uh oh, same thing. Bubble, double click. Thursday, uh oh, what a pain in the butt. Okay, easy though. Just double click, and it does it. But you see the dates? Look at that. It's already accounted for it. So when you typically most of us work Monday through Friday, but it'll work regardless um, on whatever days you need to keep track of time. But this is just for simplification. So Monday. You just put in that date and then the rest of the week will automatically auto populate and you are good to go. Thank you.